Hello and welcome to another episode of the Timeless Food Travels. Today I'm with my friend Jurgen. Hi. <laughs> He's actually also a vlogger. He's got his own channel. Uh, there's going to be a link uh, for his channel down below. It's called Enjoy Life in the Philippines. And that's what he's doing. That's, that's what we're both doing. We're enjoying life here in the Philippines. So I previously made a video over here in uh, Tink's Burgers, Hot Dogs and Shakes. Also Pizza Sisters. But this time we're going this, which is right next door. It's a little bit more hidden, a little bit less Lama. well known, I suppose. But this is called the Hotel Bar. I had previously shot a walkthrough of this place under much better lighting conditions during lunchtime hours before the crowds and the copyrighted music created the explosive atmosphere that I unfortunately cannot show here. I recommend for you to watch this earlier video of the Pink Sports Bar and Restaurant, which is an extension of the same business and shares the same great kitchen and friendly staff. The hotel bar can accurately be described as a lounge within a club within a bar. I guess you can call it a barception. And now back to the night out with my friend Jurgen. <laughs> a little bit more relaxed over here and if you want to actually have a quieter conversation where you can enjoy yourself without having to yell the whole time you can enjoy it right over here it's kind of like a different vibe you get the idea let's check out the food menu right the burger looks good the menu by the way very simple on the front hotel bar uh, there's some hidden items actually kind of like the hidden rooms that you have a few choices of the hot dogs and burgers chili cheese dog for you again it looks like there's a lot of cheese on top of that so really nice, yeah. Have a drink on me. <laughs> we both got a beer, Paul Anner. German beer. German by beer. The way. Some of the best beer in the world, actually. Paul Anner rocks. And now I'm waiting for my food to come. Try not to make a mess. <laughs> the hot dog is very um, involved. Very, very hot. Mm -hmm. There's so much stuff on top of that hot dog. One hand must be must stay clean for the beer. But my dog, speaking of which, is right here. This is the East LA hot dog. Thank you very much. This right here is a masterpiece. I actually tried this one time before and I was absolutely overwhelmed. Flashback. Wow, wait. This is super loaded. Look at this. So much stuff over here. Seriously, this is the most impressive looking hot dog I've ever had in my, my life by far. Nothing comes close to this. This is so freaking incredible. End of flashback. Normally, I don't really think of hot dogs as a serious kind of food. To me, it's more like mystery meat, but this right here is truly remarkable. With the jalapeno peppers, tomatoes, and the onions, all the stuff on here, it's really a sight to behold. Oh my God. Last time I was having it, that did not happen, I promise. I was able to have an almost flawless kind of meal with basically uh, no loss whatsoever. Unlike the first time that I had this hot dog, this particular one had a much thicker casing, which caused a slight bursting when I was biting into it. I guess that not every two hot dogs are gonna be the same. This hot dog is really what they're known for, and I can tell why. It's remarkable what they were able to do with it. This is just for uh, wow, Thank that. you. Thank you very much, sir. It looks even bigger than before. Margarita pizza. Yeah, yeah, I think that's gonna be big enough for both of us. Yeah, what do you think? Before she said seven or eight inch, then she said 14 inch, but this looks even yeah. more than 14 inch. That's a pretty big one, yeah. I think it's gonna be more than enough. And I think it was a good choice. This margarita is for me always just a basic pizza. I want more than basic. It's it a really, really good. good place. I mean, like, they, they do know how to make good food, good quality food over here. But the good thing is that they are connected with the kitchen from this restaurant. Yeah. In, in such a bar, you would never get such food yeah this kind of bar to mix with this kind of quality food that's not something you would typically expect but yeah this place is special that way really really special for special people mm. what do you think mm. is it decent very good oh my god it smells so good <laughs> yeah. so yeah we're done with the place we had an awesome dinner right the food was great Unexpected good. Unexpectedly good, yeah. I mean, like, who would think that um, pizza and the hot dog could be that amazing? But yeah, there it is. The hotel bar has amazing food and really great drinks as well. So this is where we're going to be closing out this video. If you liked it, please hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Always take care of yourselves and each other. And of course, keep looking out for more fun and exciting videos coming at you from the Timeless Food Channels. See you in the next Bye. one. Try it out. Epilogue. Remember.
reminds me of old days. Okay. I love it. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. Check it out. Yeah, I checked it out already. Here's a little bit of bonus content for you. Cheers. Here's the beer bunny because of the hops. Beer bunny hops. This is the rye beer. Uh, it's very different flavor. Uh, it's very malty and very hoppy. <laughs> I love this thing. This is so good. I love trying new things like that, especially when it hits the spot. And this one definitely does. Not bad, huh? Cheers. Pretty good stuff. Cheers.